very sorry. Those words from Nicki Minaj over backlash from her latest video. But first, it's Swift versus Spotify. The gloves are off in the tussle between Taylor Swift and Spotify. The CEO of the music streaming service is slamming the idea that Spotify rips off musicians. In a blog post, Daniel Elf writes, Spotify had paid a total of $2 billion to music labels and their associated artists since 2008. And he says Swift was on track to make $6 million from the site this year. Swifty recently pulled all of her albums from the site because she believes the service doesn't fairly compensate music makers. On a day dedicated to honoring fallen soldiers, Nicki Minaj is apologizing. Minaj is saying sorry for what some believe to be Nazi imagery in the new video for her song Only. On Twitter, the 31-year-old says, I didn't come up with the concept, but I'm very sorry and take full responsibility if it has offended anyone. I'd never condone Nazism in my art. Minaj explains that a cartoon influenced the video's concept. Move over Olivia Pope, Rihanna is in Washington doing her best impression of the leading lady from City's hit show Scandal. The singer posed for pics ahead of tonight's Concert for Valor in the American capital for Veterans Day in the U.S. Bruce Springsteen and Carrie Underwood will also be performing at the first of its kind of event that's expected to draw hundreds of thousands of fans to D.C. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. Hey, this is Mary J. Blige letting you know that I will be performing on a very Grammy Christmas. It's official. Blige, a nine-time Grammy winner, is the latest performer added to the holiday special lineup, joining the likes of Pharrell Williams, Ariana Grande, host LL Cool J, and more. You can catch it on City December 5th. It's a comeback story with moves. Full Out is based on the real-life story of gymnast Ariana Berlin, who suffered a near-fatal car accident. The movie was filmed in Toronto, where our Brad Smith visited the set. A movie's being created about your story. What's it like being on set with the actors and seeing them play your life? It's, it's unbelievable. It, it still isn't real to me. Berlin has her own role in the film as a stunt double for the actress who is portraying her. She is so inspirational. I am so grateful that I get to play such an incredible person. Jennifer Beals of Flashdance fame plays Berlin's coach. If you see the story about Ariana, you go, well, okay, that happened to her and this is happening to me, but you know what? I can do it. I'm going to I'm gonna persevere. Full Out is set to spring into theaters next year. And they continue to dominate country music on tomorrow's Entertainment City. We chat with the one and only Lady Antebellum. Entertainment City, brought to you by Fallsview Casino Resort in Niagara Falls, the place you want to be.